Hello Ability Power Gamers and welcome back to another First Look Friday. This week I'm really excited to be checking out, finally, FTL. FTL is like, it looks like a really fun space game. And I've been wanting to try it with you guys forever. So let's check it out. First we're going to look at the options. Alright, let's see what we have. Uh, the game started in windowed mode. It does have full screen mode. In case you need it. Uh, we have colorblind mode. You can turn it on and off. Of course we've got sliders for volume. Alright, gameplay. I'm oh, sorry, the rest of the video options. Normal stuff, dynamic backgrounds, vertical scene, things you generally find in video games. Uh, gameplay, we have event, choice, selection, no delay. Uh, show beacon pass on hover. Achievement pop-ups. Window focus auto pause. Alright, that's one that I actually like. If you need to pause the game quickly, you can just click outside the window area and bam, pause. You don't have to hit escape or find the pause button. And then we have configure keyboard hotkeys. Let's see what that is. Wow. Guys, look at all the keyboard bindings. You can change to however you need them. Um, you can select crew. Uh, make them run to stations. Open doors, teleport. Uh, there's weapon slots. You can jump, pause game. Wow. Two whole pages. Uh, power engines. Power oxygen. Wow. Lots and lots and lots of keybind options. Now, I don't know if this is enough to actually play the whole game with only a keyboard, but maybe we can find out. Alright, let's go back and try it out. Alright, so here we are. Um, at the ship select, you know, setup thing. Um, now, since we just started, this is the ship we get. Pretty much. Uh, you see, everything is locked. So, yeah, we get the one ship. Oh, yep, hey, there we go. Uh, also, layout, there's different layouts, also is still locked. You can change your crew members. You got your weapons here. You have easy, normal, hard. Uh, you can enable advanced edition if that's the version of the game you have. Or leave it off. We're just gonna leave it off because I really don't know what I'm doing yet. And might as well start in the basic game. I do see one problem. Look, it's a beautiful ship, guys. That doesn't look like it should be named the Kestrel. No, no, no. There is only one ship that I think we should be flying. Oh, that's right. Serenity. And you can rename your ship whatever you want. I'm going with Serenity. I did that with my own screen keyboard with no problem. Since I'm in Windows mode. But you can name your ship whatever you want. There's lots of famous ones out there. I mean, yeah, you have Deep Thought from uh, Hitchhiker's Guide. You have 
Oh, what's the one for escape? I can't think of her name. She wasn't really a ship, though. She was more of a giant creature. Alright, now check this out. Zero crew. Customize. You can rename them, too. Oh. Well, we need a captain. Definitely. And if you're gonna be flying Serenity, it has to be Captain Malcolm Reynolds. I mean, there's, there's no other choice. There we go, except. And if we're gonna be flying around, we're gonna have to have someone to keep the ship running, fix any boo-boos. So that has to be Kaylee. I mean, she loves Serenity, right? Alright, and there we go. And third member. Okay, well, we got someone to farm. We got someone to fix it. We need some protection. Yes. The one, the only. Chain. Oops. Grab. I mean, I think you can protect the ship better than anyone. Alright, let's see what we have here. There we go. Accept. Alright guys, I think we're ready. But you know what? We're doing it on easy. Because, I'm telling you guys, it's hard to play games and like... Concentrate and talk. Alright, the data you carry is a battle. To the remaining Federation fleet. You will need supplies for this journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving to the next. But if you get to the exit... Oh, but we have to get to the exit before the rebel fleet can catch up. Oh, hey. Continue. Alright, so... Here's the screen that... Yeah, or space screen. We've got our weapons down here. There's an auto fire button. Hmm. Alright. Well, let's let's go get him. Jump. Alright. Oh, there's this distress call. Someone might need help. Ah, uh, well. Let's go get him. No power in the first can stop us, right? Alright. You have encountered a refugee ship drifting in space. It looks like it was fleeing the rebel advance. Okay, maybe we were in Star Wars, not Firefly. Who knows? <laughs> and right out of fuel. This stress beacon is active. But you're not sure if anyone's on board. Do we hail them? Or do we ignore the refugees? Hmm. Okay. We're gonna help build them. Alright, as you're the refugee ship, a Volton ship suddenly jumps into the system and it claims the refugees are criminals and accuses you of escorting fugitives before you can respond it cuts communications and powers up its weapons well time for some thrilling heroics don't you guys think all right here we go uh do we shoot uh shoot uh okay maybe i need more of this here here, uh, take that out of there. I don't... What's going on, guys? Wait, go, go, shoot! Shoot, okay. So you had to click here, and then here. Here, and here. Here, and here. 
this other fire, I guess. There. Go, go, go! Go! Oh, what? We won! Alright. Oh, I have no idea what I'm doing, but... We won! So that's good, right? Alright, the Bolton ship breaks apart. And you salvage what you can. Contact the refugee ship. Okay. The refugees, thank you for your assistance as a jester. Goodwill. Uh, and seeing how you effectively dispatch the enemy ship, they offer you what supplies they can spare. Well, that's sweet. Okay, well, now we gotta fix our ship. Okay. Fix here. So we send all the guys to work on it. There we go. Alright, that's working. We got our shorts up. Alright. Now we look like we're in decent shape now. Alright, we got to figure this out. I remember I did the tutorial. And to use that weapon, we have to have more of this. Hmm. Okay, maybe I have to, like, take one out of here? No. Oh! Okay, you had to click on the circle. Alright, well, that makes more sense. Alright, so that's how you change that. Or an auto fire back off. Alright, I think our first mission was a success. What do you guys think? Alright, let's try one more. Well, wait. We can't jump yet. Hmm. <clears throat> What's wrong with that? Oh, no pilot. Okay, okay, uh, you. Mount, back to the front. No, seriously. Back to the front. I'm gonna put Kaylee over here. Okay, now we can jump. Ah. Ah, right, here we go. I aim to misbehave. We're gonna do it again. Where should we go? Here? Or here? I want to try to get close to the exit, but not necessarily... get out of the exit yet, so... Right there. Here we go. A ship tells you. Good sir, it seems you're having some troubles with the rebels. I'd like to help you, but I can't afford the upkeep required on this hunk of junk I'm flying. Maybe we could come to an arrangement. Alright, we can hire the mercenary to delay the rebels. We can hire the mercenary to scout the sector. We can fight the ship. Or, we have no need. Yeah, we, we have no need for your services. Okay. So that means we can jump in. Oh, a store! Let's go to the store. Alright, the transmission from the nearby planet indicates an outpost below which offers supplies. Alright. Oh, we can fix everything. Yes, I want to fix everything. Yay! Okay. Uh, Alright, we have combat drones. Hmm. System repair drone. Hmm. Oh, how is a drone port to deploy? Don't know what that means. Oh, we can buy drone ports. Oh, 
Okay, so you have to buy these to use the drones. And then we've got fuel. And, oh, maybe we should get some fuel. I don't know. Uh, we'll get some missiles and fuel. And now we can't afford the drone, but that's okay. Wait, we didn't sell? No. Alright, here we go, guys. Hmm. Jumping again. Danger, danger, okay. You jump into the middle of a plasma storm. Multiple recently incapacitated ships loom in the shadows, briefly illuminated by the lighting. Alright, manually search the wreckage or avoid the risk. Oh, come on, guys, we're Serenity. Of course. We're searching the wreckage. Alright. I mean, we have to keep flying, right? Among the junk and scrap you find, salvageable drone schematic. Alright, we decided to quit while we're ahead. Well, that doesn't sound like us. Okay. Gonna jump to here. You recognize the ship is a well-known slave trader. He owes you and offers you, you offers you laborers for cheap. Buy one slave and free them to join the crew. Attack the slaver scum. Or ignore the slaver and continue. You know what? I mean you can't have slaves. Oh. That's just that's just not right. So we're gonna we're gonna attack him. We are gonna attack him and be big damn heroes. Here we go. Where's that oh, it's thing? There we go. Attack. Attack you. Going to put that there. We're going to really blow him up. We surrender! Take one of our slaves as tribute. If you destroy us, they'll die anyway. Okay, fine. I don't want to kill the slaves. Except... There we go. So we have a new person on our ship. Is that him? Ah, oh, there he is. Alright, so... So far, everything... has been point and click. Uh, really easy. I'm not having any problems. Uh, the, the weapons, I mean, you have to be kind of quick. Like, click it, click the ship, click it, click the ship. But, you can pause the game between every turn. So, you know, if, if you get so getting tired, your arm starts hurting the hand, you can just pause it. And if, you know, you can't make the moves quick enough, you can pause it, queue up an attack, unpause it, let it go off, and do that kind of deal. But FTO is really fun. I mean... Check it out. Really fun so far. Of course, we're still on run easy. But... I love that. I love that you can rename things. And with windowed mode, you don't have a problem using your on screen keyboard, which is perfect. But, you know, don't take my word for it. It's on Steam. Check it out. If you already have this game, leave me a comment below. Let me know how far you've gotten, what you think about it. As always, if you want to see more of this type of content, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Or you can follow us on Facebook or Twitter. And we'll see you next time on Ability Powered.